All right, so once again, thank you so much for coming to talk to us at the conference today. Can you just uh, reintroduce yourself? My name is Marcus Goodwin. I'm a, an entrepreneur. I run a real estate firm and a software company. I build affordable housing and I manage that in the real estate company. The software company is a housing benefits platform. We help people access home ownership by connecting them with realtors, title companies, and mortgage lenders. All right, so we're doing it all on the housing side. Um, Correct. First of all, how did you uh, enjoy the conference today? I love the experience. I met a lot of brilliant people that asked questions that made me think myself. Mm -hmm. And the other panelists were just super smart, super thoughtful, and we were all four from different cities. So I thought it was interesting to see perspective from different locales. Definitely. With all those different perspectives, what are some uh, takeaways that you're bringing with you from this conference? First and foremost, everyone has a different strategy. Mm -hmm. I'm in DC, there's a gentleman from Philadelphia, a gentleman from Chicago, and a woman from Pennsylvania. And we're all working in the same industry, but in slightly different roles. We all have a different pathway to success. So there's no one path, there's your own path, and the own way that's gonna be fulfilling to you and exciting to you to do the job. Absolutely, it's an individual path. But with that, um, how do we kind of um, tackle this housing issue. I'm not asking you to obviously solve it, but how do we make housing a political issue where we're having candidates speak on that and how are we are going to take our voters to push those issues forward? So I think maybe the fortunate and unfortunate part about politics is that politicians only respect votes. Right. So from a housing perspective as a business person, if I get the people behind me and they support what I'm bringing to the community because I've been thoughtful about the infrastructure, the parking, the education, the nonprofit, the use of mutual space, then I've got voters behind me. Mm -hmm. Similarly, if the people want to yield power, then they have to be a collective. They have to concentrate around these technological platforms like politicking and let the politicians know we are so, however so many people strong, and this is what we care about. We want affordable units, we want government subsidy, mm -hmm. we want our tax dollars to be benefiting us with better schools, recreation centers, infrastructure. Down payment assistance. Down payment assistance, mm -hmm. education, financial wellness, all of these things, people have to get together collaboratively and demand that from politicians. So whether you're on the business side, or on the community side, getting people together is the key. There you go, it's power in numbers. Yeah. Appreciate your time. Thank you. Thank you. Good meeting you.